Hello everyone, hope you guys are doing well. Welcome back to some more of the long dark. It is dark at the moment because it's like literally just coming up um, morning time and we do not need sleep or anything. But if I'm not mistaken, this is episode 32 of like the third series and the previous series um, I did, we got to uh, part 43. So I'm closing in on it. However, the series that we did before this, I got to 120 days. Whereas this one, we are only currently on 93 days. So I'm wondering if we will get to the 120 days before I hit part 40 or <laughs> before we hit part 43 but thank you for the comments about whether i should do the bear skin bedroll or um jacket a lot of you were saying jacket so i think that's what we're going to do and i think i might do a little bit of it n oh no i can't do it now because it's not cured 47 okay 56 47 so we still have time we still have time but yeah so thank you guys so much for that i think i will go for the uh, jacket and then uh, hopefully later down the line we will be able to get the bedroll as well just because i feel like it will be really handy so when i make that i will leave the wolf one here um obviously because there's no point in taking it with us also i did a wee little bit of tidying up we have some water over here I made some more coffee. Incredibly burnt stuff. Oh wait, no, what? Why is it... Oh, inedibly burnt. <gasps> oh my goodness, I did not realise. I swear when I took it off, it was not burnt. It was not burnt. Unless it got burnt because it was stayed hot for a little while. Anyway, so okay. I only have four cups of coffee, which sucks. Um, I've left some flares here. I do still have quite a few <laughs> have nine i swear i will do a series where like i limit myself with things and i like only use the revolver or i like only am allowed to take like three or four flares with me at the time one time we will do something like that um so yeah i have lantern lantern fuel um there's a bow there um i would like to make some arrows uh over here we have that's it. We have a bunch of Tinder plugs. Oh, also, thank you for telling me that I actually do not need um, to use Tinder now. Um, it is optional. <laughs> I was completely oblivious to that. Um, but yeah, firewood, blah, blah, blah. And also, I did, um, I did cook some meat because... Um, I could, yeah, I cooked some bear meat, cooked some wolf meat over here. There's this stuff here, which it's losing its, like, goodness, I guess. Like, really quick. And I don't know if that is, like, supposed to happen or not. But I don't know if, I don't know if that's good. I don't know if that's good. So I'm just going to eat, um, I'm going to eat this wolf meat and I'm going to drink some water and pretty much i don't need to take all of that water with me because i'm hoping that the house we go to has a toilet <laughs> i hope it has a toilet so i can just grab some i can just grab some water there so i will leave um maybe i'll leave like one point okay so yeah we'll take the revolver with us I do not actually need the reclaimed wood. Please just let me drop all of it in one go. You need like X amount before it does that. Um, I have upgraded this. Um, or like repaired it. Sorry. Um, these were good. Oh, one of the comments mentioned like what you think is like a good, um, or what you wear regularly i can't remember exactly what it was but i want to have a look at that to see compare it with like my own stuff what if what is my affliction is it still frostbite yeah, yeah, yeah of course of course of course it's frostbite um but yeah anyway sorry we are going to head oh shit wait where are you
I hit you. Um, yeah, so we are going to go to the house that is over there. <laughs> Um, because that's what we were going to do in the last episode, but we found the bear, and then I took down another bear, so I feel like that- Oh, and we searched those cabins over that way. Or was it over there? Yeah, I think over there in that way, in that general direction. We, um... Are you gonna still- um, what happens when we do this? I thought maybe we'd shoot them. Okay, revolver firearm expert. Nice! Let me just get into this house really quick. Because I feel like I have a broken limb or something. My health's going down, so maybe... What do we got? Uh, pain, sprained ankle. Okay, let's take something for the sprained ankle then. I don't know if six bandages is too much to take with me, but we're doing it. That's what that's what we do. <laughs> that's what we do. Also, 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 I did sort of like a dry run, if you like. It was um it was like a pilgrim game or I did a custom game and I just made everything like super super easy, which I could have just did a pilgrim game. It would have helped out um but anyway i went to timberwolf mountain and i actually made it to the peak of timberwolf mountain the first time i've ever done it so i got an achievement for it um just because i wanted to sort of know where i was going when i eventually go here because i really really do want to eventually go here and then from here i made it to the peak there was some cool stuff up there and those in like the what do you call it? I was going to call it a shipwreck. The freaking the plane, like containers. There was one that was filled with like clothes. One that was filled with like food. It was just, it was cool. I think that's a good place um, to get some stuff. But yeah, I do really eventually want to go here. And from here, I actually went to Ash Canyon and I made it into the gold mine where I actually found the tactical backpack and the crampons, crampons, however you say those little snow tready things um which was really cool so that is definitely somewhere that i would like to go and that i really do want to go in this series at some point but at the moment we are down here so i would go from here to mystery lake um to the winding river and then pleasant valley I can't remember how we get to Pleasant Valley from Mystery Lake. I don't know. I'll figure it out. I'll figure it out. Anyway, what's in here? Should I search in here while we're here? Or should I, should I have like a little nap? It's clear outside, so I kind of don't want to waste too much time. Have I searched this place? This place looks awfully familiar. Is this like the exact... I think this is like the exact same layout as one of the cabins that we went to. Okay, I will leave this for now, just because it's fairly close. So, oh, also, I'm sorry, there's so much also going on. Um, uh, one of you mentioned that you can climb. I think it was with like a lit um, torch or something. I actually managed to climb with a lit flare, which was really nice. I think the last time I tried to do, I don't know if that's something new that they've added, but the last time I tried to climb with like a lit flare or something, um, it, he dropped the flare at the bottom. Wait, are my things still over here? Or have they been ripped apart? Oh no, they're still here. They're still here. Question is, do we unpack? I don't know. Is it good to leave them quartered in their little sacks? Because they're 42% already. They're 42% already? That seems awfully low. Right, has the bear respawned? If you have, I'm gonna cry. Please don't respawn. Please don't respawn while I'm like, walking in front of you. In front of your wee little cave because they don't have the rifle. Okay, I don't see him. Unless he's hidden around the corner. 
Okay, I don't think he's in there. I think we're good. I think we're good. I think we're good. Okay, let's get up here. Oh, I do I have? I do have some charcoal on me. Nice. Because we will get up here and I will... Survey? Let me get the revolver. Okay, Wolfo is going after... Is there a bear? Is that what you're scared of? Oh my god. Is it scared of the bear or was it running away from me? Hot oh, damn, can I survey? That's like little That's like little wolf pitter patters, right? I can't. Okay, I'm gonna get, <laughs> get inside. I'm gonna get inside and I'm gonna see if there is a bed. Hopefully there is one. I don't think I bought my bedroll, did I? I'm gonna sleep a couple hours. Just until it's morning so I can go outside and survey. Okay, right. That's fine. Should we see how bad the weather is? Because I don't want to... Please don't be a storm. Hey, no, it's fine. Right. Okay, awesome. This is what I like to see. It all being connected. It all being connected. Right, so I went to that one. Is it super cold? There's a fishing hut there, little bunny rabbits. Should I fish? Or is that not worth it? I think on my, hmm, I think I might hit, is there another house over on that hill? I think I might go from here over to that hill, survey, and then nip into the fishing huts on my way back. Yeah, depending on how much stuff I pick up in this house, actually. If I pick up a lot of stuff in here, then maybe I won't. But if I don't pick up a lot of stuff, then we'll just make a... We'll make a, a little circuit or something. Oh, yes. I might like this. Just because we have a lot of stuff. This will come in handy. I can't remember if the urban parker is any good. I mean, the weight of it is good. What does it do? Long heavy coat. Uh, more suitable to urban survivalists, but extra length might keep your kidneys warm. <laughs> I mean, my kidneys are like here. We're warm. We're warm. At least I think that's where the kidneys are. Not a I could use this. <laughs> um, soda. Take it. I also, while I was in the garage, I was just like searching stuff and I was like trying to tidy some stuff up and everything like that. And I found some, I think it was some rifle rounds or some revolver rounds behind like um, the cabinet just as you walk in the door. Oh my goodness, a cooking pot. Yes, I think this is the first, no. I think I have a cooking pot back at base base, but to be honest, I really like the garage area here, and like it's my favorite place to call the base base. But um, along with the like um, cabin in Mystery Lake, this is probably like my second or first favorite, and then the cabin in Mystery Lake is. Either a second or first. I don't know. They're probably just tied. <laughs> they're probably just tied. I think when the series ends or whatever, um, I might do, I might try another challenge or if there is a region that you would specifically like me to 
start off at then we'll do something like that where i start off at a region that you guys suggest or i do a difficulty um that you guys suggest also the interloper and the one below that i read somewhere or i think it was one of you that said it i can't remember don't quote me but rifles and that just don't spawn which I feel like is so unfair. I feel like I heavily, heavily rely. Could end up being useful. On um, the rifle <laughs> and stuff here, especially the revolver. But apparently, neither of them spawn in, like the higher, higher difficulties, which sucks. So I think maybe I should set myself a challenge of like when this series is over or maybe just like along the side i should do a challenge where we just do voyager um yeah the sec what one are we on now um yeah where we just do the one that we're on now but i only use the bow because i think that if the rifle and that isn't available in the like hardest difficulty or the next one up from this one then i'm gonna have a real problem because i have <laughs> not used the bow at all and i definitely have not killed anything with the bow ever so that is gonna be a disaster if I go straight into that sort of like challenge I guess and not being able to use the um a rifle or a revolver but I also do think that I might leave the revolver here oh shit I think I might actually just just reload this but yeah, I think when I leave this area, I might leave the revolver depending on how much stuff I want to take with me. Because I know the bearskin jacket is going to be a little bit heavier. Um, I know also I have a revolver at base base. So, I have one. There, maybe I could just leave this one here and take the bullets with me. I don't know. What am I doing for carry weight? Mm, my carry weight's kind of high. But I did pick up a jacket in that that I don't... Oh, there is a house over there. Oh, there's something over there. Oh, I love that little tower. I can't look at towers like that. I've probably said it before, but without thinking of them, um, Firewatch. That was a good game. That was a good game. Sad, but good. Sad. Have I been to that cabin? It wasn't that Kevin. No, it wasn't. Okay, let's go to this one. Then we'll go to the other hill. And then from the other hill, I think I'll work my way back just to like base for the moment. Check on the bear hides. Um, let's survey. Yeah, check on the bear hides. Drop off some stuff and then head out to the next area. Um, I'm not sure I can carry oh, much Oh, hello, beautiful. I'm going to take you with me. <laughs> this is what I mean. I take far too much stuff. If I can't run... No, I don't want to do that. If I can't run, then we're going to have an issue. It's a shame you never find the rifles and they are already... They're like full of ammo that would be good that would be good because then you could like unload them and you have extra bullets and leave the gun behind okay yeah so um, or do we just head straight back we're already like over here now let me get up to the top of this house and we will see it might be a trek back because of the weight situation but if I can drop the jacket um, and stuff I really want to go into the water and see what <laughs> happens 
Is that weird? It's probably a bit weird. Just a bit weird. To repair the bear skin coat, I think I do need like a bear skin. Do I hear a bear? Where I heard a bear. Okay, Jackrabbit Island. Cute. There was a house up here, I swear there was. Oh yeah, I see it. I like whenever I come across these things I like click on them, but I honestly don't think they really do absolutely anything. I don't think they do anything at all. Right. Okay, so good, we can go in here. I think I'm just gonna get up here. What's that? I think it's a boat. Okay, I'm sorry. Woo! Oh, I love when a map starts to come together. What's down here? Is there a dead guy? I think there is, but I don't want to go down. Is it a guy? What is it? It must be a guy or a deer or something. Please don't. Oh my god, please, please. Okay, thank you. Fucking. I hope we can get back up here. There was a part. Um, as I was exploring Ash Canyon or whatever it was, no, not Ash Canyon, um, Timberwolf Mountain, that I was, I dropped down somewhere, but I was literally, I was stuck and I couldn't, I couldn't get out and I had to just like continue to drop down. It was bad. It was where like a tiny little climb or jump would come in so handy. Okay, cool water. I didn't bring any like meat with me. Um so I think I'll just like eat these snacks that I find right. Are we gonna find another cooking pot? Cause that would help because I was trying to make a bunch of water just so like I always had it there. But um I made a fair amount, but I actually didn't realise how much water we go through. It's a lot, it's a lot. I think I drink more water than I do eat food. <laughs> this house is not looking old. Oh, any good to eat. Trust me, we will eat it. Since um, one of the comments a while ago mentioned that like eating food, eating like really bad food before you go to bed and like obviously take the antibiotics or whatever it is and then go to sleep. Like, oh, that was another thing. That was like one of the best um, bits of advice. So I swear one of the comments said to wear two of these. Put some weight down. Screw it. I'm gonna wear two of them. Um, can I harvest this? Let's harvest this. I'm gonna wear two of them. And I've also got two of the red pair of leggings on. It was just the weight that I was so like worried about. Heavy duty military pants, designed to take a beating. So I prefer those are on the inside. Would it be better to wear them on the outside I guess it would be better to wear them on the outside no because the crampon crampon things <laughs> they go into an accessory slot um when I like when I tested it out they went into an accessory slot which was oh shit I've still got my lantern on I'm an idiot I'm an actual idiot Oh hello! I'm not gonna be able to carry this load for much longer. 
Do you think I could dismantle one? Actions. I can only clean it. Um. I have two of these guys as well. No, yeah, I only have one of those on me. I don't know. I think I might leave it here. Should I leave it here? Stick a little note in the um in the journal thing. Um, because I could leave some water here as well. I don't know if I'd ever actually come back to the like this house out of the two that are on the hills. Yeah, I think I'll leave it here. I haven't even searched the freaking living room yet. Okay, right. Let's leave. Let's drop this here. And let's drop... Let's drop two liters All of this water. gear is slowing me down. I will leave a little note. No. I'll leave a little note in the journal. For myself. Ah, uh, there's a jacket there. No flares. Oh, pair Feels of like a trail lot of gear. boots. I think I have trail boots on, don't I? Yeah, trail boots. I can't remember what pair of boots one of the comments said was a good pair. Was it the hiking boots or military boots or something like that? I'm just going to harvest these real quick. Okay, right. Let's... I didn't bring any coffee with me. Oh, and I also haven't found any coffee. Oh my goodness. I don't want to move off in this. I really don't want to move off on this. Would it be frowned upon if I stayed here for the day? <laughs> if I stayed here for the day and I just like, I harvest up some clothes? I think I'm going to stay here for the night. I think I am going to stay here for the night. I have a book on me. I think I might read an hour or two of that. I just really don't like moving off when it's super, super misty. Call it what you like. <laughs> Call it fancy. It's fine. Um, I'm fine with that. I feel like it's one of those things where it's like, I would rather be safe and cautious than sorry. After like the stupid little mistakes that I've made for shelter. about getting frostbite and all of that stuff. And then in the series before this where I just decided to literally sleep out in the open when there was a perfectly good cabin. Just little mistakes like that. I <laughs> I never want to make those again. So I'm pretty um I wanna try and be like cautious about it. I think you knowing as well that there is a bear and stuff around here. Um and wolves, I just literally don't want to be walking through the mist and come face to face with one because it's kind of horrifying. Get rid of these tins. Like, get rid of the sodas. Because we can always make more water. And it puts the food up a little bit, so it's like a win-win, really. Right, okie dokie. Okay, right, it is clearer now. It's not perfect. Right, there are the houses over there, but because I am slightly heavy at the moment anyway, I think I'm just gonna make a beeline straight back, check on my bear hides. I might go over. I've been to that. No, let's go this way. I'll check the two fishing huts along the way, but. We're not cold, which is a real bonus. Let's see if this does anything. Eh, it done a little bit. Okay, yay, clear of weather. <laughs> this is the type of weather that I, I can't wait to get up there. Although I'm not sure how much will be over there. We did go into those um, little huts over there. So, I don't know if they want to be my next port of call. Because I will leave a note and everything saying that I left. Because um, there'll be a bunch of bear meat left at this place. Like, I hate, I hate leaving stuff 
in places. I know that you can come back to them, but it's just the fact that obviously the durability of them, or like, I guess for food wise, it's like the condition of them goes down, so they get worse. But I just, I just hate leaving stuff. I hate it. I just want to take everything with me all the time. Probably should have gone to get that tactical backpack before I like did all of this. But as I'm here now, I just feel like it's too late as it's like a really, really long trek. And that's providing I remember the way um, in Timberwolf Mountain. So when it comes to that time, hopefully I can remember the way and hopefully we actually make it that far. So I think what I will do, I will go into the gas station, drop off some stuff, check the bear hides and then just search the cabins that are like right next to the gas station. Oh, can I survey here? Would this be too bad of a place to survey? I don't want a bear to come out. I start looking for like little black dots on the map when I'm surveying if I see one it's like almost game over. <laughs> oh what would be really cool in this if you, if you had like um, a, a what's it called like a bear spray like a bear repellent spray thing I'm just gonna survey here really quick okay cool so that's all like connected now which is good. Good, 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 good. Let's get back to the cabin. Because I can leave a rifle here. Oh, I haven't searched this place, but I will do it. I just nipped in because we had um, a sprain. It only looks like there's the two houses to search here. Coastal town side. Oh, this looks like oh, there's actually a basement of this one. Can we go in this basement? We can't. Damn it. Okay, there is the wolfo, or is that bearo? Is that? Oh no, I thought that was the um. What do you call it? The moose. Oh, I also. <laughs> To try and make some more water, I made like two little campfires out the front here. Okay, I'm just gonna go outside, inside. Uh, yeah, I made like two little campfires out the front and I was just like doing water. I was doing water all the time. So, I do have another one of these, which I don't know whether to leave this stuff here because, um, it's the bleak. Can we get to the bleak inlet from Coastal Highway? I don't know if we can. Might have to look that up. Right, how are we doing? 59 and 68. Okay, so we are doing, and the guts are all cured. We're doing pretty well. I did get this as well. Um, it's 73%. So there's some spray can stuff. We'll put the hundred one down. Okay, good. So we are, we're back at our temporary base. Haven't had to use a flare. I used some revolver shots, yada yada. I left the revolver there. Let's drop this one. Something's this is go. the bad rifle, so we'll leave that one. Uh, we'll put that one at the back and I will... I'll have to leave a, like a note here or something to let me know that. Can I repair this? <gasps> I can. I need a simple toolkit. I had a simple toolkit here. Okay, right. Um, we are. It's almost night time, but we have a little bit of um. I'm wondering if the wolves keep coming around here because of all this meat I've left. <laughs> and how are these doing? See, 23% and 30%. I really feel like they're going down a lot more than what I thought they 
would or should. So, we are going to... I really want to break down the rest of these pallets as well. But yeah, like, outside the front, I just made two little campfires to batch build water and stuff like that. Um, there is no battery in there. Apparently I've already... Oh no, I haven't searched. I oh I my god, decent insulated boots. We'll check those out, but for now, let's finish off looking at the house over here and this house. And then that will probably... Let's turn around. Uh, oh, thank you. <laughs> that will probably be it for this video. But let's see what this house has in store for us. Hopefully some good stuff. I think I, when we come in here to heal my sprained ankle, I think I saw some dog food underneath the... Or is it peaches? Nope, it's dog food. Uh, soda. There's a hoodie there. I'm not too bothered about it. Cooking pot. <gasps> Did we see a cooking pot anywhere? No, but I'm not taking the tin. I have far too many tins with me. Or like, at temporary base. I think, I think we'll call it temporary base and base base. <laughs> because it's, there's so much stuff there. It can be classed as a base base. But then also my base base back at uh, Mystery Lake. I'm worried about the moose meat that's there, honestly. I don't know if it's gonna, and like the fish, I don't know if it's still gonna be good by the time we get back. That's why I feel like sometimes I just wanna like hang around in the places because you've like killed the bear or the wolf or the whatever, and it's just like, I don't want the food to go to waste. But at the same time, I also know that if I keep doing like a few videos in a row where I'm like, oh, we're just staying in one place and I'm just like hanging about inside a house, like wasting hours, I know that that's going to get slightly boring to watch. So I sometimes, not a lot, but I sometimes come on here a little bit like off camera just to do that. Like, so waste some time outside or to chop down some wood and stuff like that. Or you got a hatchet. Just so I can, like, waste some hours and use up some of the food so I'm not leaving too much behind. Like, don't get me I know it's good to leave stuff behind if you ever come back to a place. But I just worry about it losing its condition and everything. Like, really fast. Oh, a floating book. We are in witchcraft. Nothing. I think what I would do if I was ever in this situation and there was like a house where it had like a fire, I would take the mattress off the bed and any cushions and anything and I would just go and sit them in front of the fire so that like you only had to like be in one place and then tear up any of the rest of the furniture and like block off the windows and stuff so that if there's any drafts then they're not gonna get in they're not gonna get in <laughs> something like that it sounds like a zombie apocalypse like survival as well it's so clear i love it when it's like this oh wait should we get a thumbnail as i'm here maybe something like that should we turn off the lantern that's better that could be a good you guys will soon see. <laughs> You'll see if I use that one or not. I think I've surveyed this area, so... I think that's it. Oh, another tin opener? Oh, and a cooking pot! Oh, I almost Might missed the cooking pot. Gear. Great. That means we can definitely make a lot of water. So I think... Oh, and more condensed milk. So when I get back, I think that's what I might do. Chop down some more wood. I'll make a fire and I'll just make a bunch of water. And maybe I will harvest the bear meat that is outside. Um, harvest like some more. Because I really don't want it to thing in. I feel like it's oh stump remover. I feel like it's gonna disappear. So yeah let's finish searching this house. 
I hope there's some coffee. More condensed milk. I wonder how bad those ones are. Oh, no coffee. Oh, okay, so the dog food is ruined. Why is the condensed milk always so bad? 8%, 8%, 7%. I can't remember what the one is that's back. I th no, I think I didn't drop it. It's always so, so bad. Um, oh, there is a cup of coffee Better to here. have this than leave it behind. Definitely. Oh, so this place has a fireplace. See, this wouldn't be a bad home to have as a base. I don't think, anyway. Just because it has, like, a, a proper fireplace. I like the ones that have proper fireplaces. I think that's why I also like the house in Pleasant Valley, the ho um, the farm, the farmhouse I like. I think on my just like pilgrim game, that is where my base is. This gear is starting to slow me down. I know, it will all be over soon. I can't run, so hopefully we can make it back. What is this? Jeans? I don't really care for the jeans. If I can take all the water, I might as well. Because um, it will also um, take less time for the meat to cook, seeing as we have two cooking pots now as well. It just sucks that I can't get into the basement of this house. Like, it really sucks that I can't get into the basement. I can't run. <laughs> Like, just shovel some snow. We should so be able to get in there. Wolfo. Okay, I think Wolfo's gonna attack. And I'm not gonna be able to get inside quick enough. Because we've still got that house over there, and we've got the houses that way. To search. I don't know why I shouted that. I'm sorry. We've got the houses that way! Yeah, there's two of them, so I think I will do that in the next episode. Do those in the next episode. Maybe I will also make our way... Oh, okay. So we're here. I might make my way across this road and go to these fishing camps. Just because I can't remember if I left anything there or not. I know we ducked into those houses. <laughs> 69. Um, I know we ducked into those houses. Sorry. We ducked into those on the way here, but um, yeah. I don't know what I'm getting at. Uh, it's almost night time, so let's eat these condensed milks. I just wonder how many of them I can eat. Food poisoning? Oh, oh yeah. Oh, like yeah. I'm gonna die. No, we're not gonna die. We're not gonna die. Is it antibiotics? I think you take. Yeah. Okay, great. Um, it's spoiled, but we will keep it just because, you know. I actually want to keep these on me, and I want to make the herbal teas. Um. Yeah. Okay, right, so let's sleep for... I'll try and sleep for the whole hog. Anyway, for this episode, thank you guys so, so much for watching. I I hope I'm alive. Am I alive? Yeah, we're, we're alive, we're alive. No, I don't want the coffee. Oh my goodness. Do you know what? We're already halfway drinking the coffee. We might as well finish off freaking drinking. <laughs> uh, but yeah, thank you guys so, so much for watching this episode episode i hope that you are enjoying it we will definitely be making the bear skin coat um i have a bunch of stuff on me to drop at the moment um it's still it's like the middle of the night so i think what i might do is i will um oh my goodness 20 charcoal okay that, I think, is one of the things that is weighing me down an awful lot as well. Yeah, anyway, I'm going to cook some more bear meat. I'm going to cook some more water. We have a lot of water, but honestly, don't think you can have enough. <laughs> I don't think you can have enough. So, 
thank you guys so so much for watching as always thank you all for the comments and the help and the suggestions and everything like that it always does mean a lot so we'll cook all this i don't know if the bear meat the bear meat the hides will be ready once i've done that i don't think they will be although this one is 73 percent now um but yeah then we have the houses just outside of the gas station we have these two here to search oh and this one over here oh and we have the one over here <gasps> there's a lot so i think i might do this one these two check on the bear hides again and then possibly go over to the fishing camp area and try and map out this section so it's all joint um, but I'm happy with the map so far. I'm happy with what we have. I'm happy with what we've done. I'm happy with what we've done. As always, thank you guys so much. Hit the like button, leave comments. Don't forget to subscribe if you have not already. And I will see you all in the next video. Take care. Bye. Oh, I just I got food poisoning again. Great.